Hello and welcome back to Let's Play The Walking Dead, the happiest game in the world. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Yeah. Oh look, it's Ninja Bar. Don't mind if I do. Uh, let's have a look. Around. It's actually much better. Yeah, this place didn't get looted. Yeah, maybe we can rob it of money and then use the money to buy the pills. We don't want to steal, do we? Oh look, it's another energy bar. Oh great. Next to we finding herbs. Talk to Lily. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. Lily Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad? That didn't help. What's wrong with him? You're from here? What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. Got a He's temper. Got a temper. Yeah. Ah, fuck you. Yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah? Kids here. Family. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, barely seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Dum dum. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. Ah, uh, you're from around here? Where are you? I was. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Oh, we don't need one here. Oh, sorry, that's the dog outside. Ah, uh, what do you think about all this? Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Uh, yeah. The no. owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. There's something just teensy little bit strange. Oops, no. Um, about the way that people are behaving. Has, has it shocked anyone? Uh, no one's like, ah, oh, zombie. Oh, I suppose people sort of are ice cream menus. We can't let anything happen to them. I know, huh? Hey, Lee. Maybe punching him wasn't such a good idea. There were worse plans. Yeah. Says the guy who didn't get punched in the mouth. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. How's, How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's yep. just a little girl, Ken. What were you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. Yeah, it's a super girl, but I don't know. Um, if you can hear the dog outside, that's just because she's hungry and it's getting two hours away from dinner time, so this is when she starts. What's, What's the plan? plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? Macon. That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? 
Yeah, go on. They uh, own this place. They uh, pulled some bodies out of the office before we got here. They're uh, gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they did. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? No. Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves over We him. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice that killed John. Or did you we? Know what you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Console. Try to let it go. No. Oh. Mustache is sad. This game is a bit more depressing than I thought it would be. We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. We'll do that darndest. What's this? Greeting no, cards. I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead cards. Ba da da da. Oh. Hey. Let's examine the corp board. We haven't actually done anything this entire episode. Let's just talk to people. It's okay. Talk to Doug. Hello, Have Doug. Seen anything? Nothing, yeah. luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. huh. Yeah. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Yeah, Agreed. let's uh, do that. Yeah. Uh, the screen. Jesus. Oh, they're fine. I can tell him all I care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Um, yeah. yeah. I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. It's a combination lock. Oh no, 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 no! What are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Ah, I thought, oh yeah, let's... Look at the one trapped over there. Oh. Better hear than us, huh? <gasps> It's the manager! Shit. What? Do you know that guy? Kind of, he has a familiar face. Oh, you're from around here, huh? Could be anybody, you know? And they start rotting and get all cheat up and... Yep. Shut up, dog. Yep. <laughs> Shut up, dog. Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore. Duh! With keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. You do that, Doug. Uh, what else can we find? Lee's brother. Oh, that's Lee's brother. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification. Wait, over there. wait, wait, wait. Uh, it didn't work. That's Lee's brother. We'll prove that that guy worked here, and then we can try to clear the street to search him for the keys. Yeah, probably easier said than done. That's not kind of a, a good way. 
Can't reach that brick. Maybe if Doug moved out of the rows. How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. Yep. Where are you? I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Uh, we've been over this. Good people. Yeah, okay. Let's go back inside. Let's head back inside. Okay. Okay. It's kind of strange though how people react. It's like, isn't the dead walking around? Um, I don't know. You'd think there'd be a little bit more of a reaction. What are you around with there? It's a radio. radio. I can't get it to work though. Oh. Here, let me have a look. Power. Oh, have you have you tried the power button? No. Nothing. Not that volume. Oh, that would certainly. Nothing. No. Flip the radio over. Well, let's look over here. Have we put the antenna up? She's not very good at this, is she? Let's have a look at the batteries. Battery door. Oh, there's no batteries in the sea. Do you know that there are no batteries in that thing? Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. no. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Yeah. Kind. You're a no. pretty good shot. Well, I'm gonna fuck just... with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. Sounds like Dead Rising. <laughs> you seem to handle oh, yourself pretty game. well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me, and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. 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 <laughs> uh... Oh, I don't know what I was going to say is strange about the way that they're behaving. There's like this, obviously, where we, uh, there's so much saturation of zombie culture in everywhere that we don't question it. And it's not that the people aren't questioning it, but if it's so strange, then they're handling it kind of weirdly. It's like, oh no, the dead were walking, why are they dead? Uh, it's just, I don't know, maybe I'm overthinking it. That guy saved you? Yeah, can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. See, her reaction's a bit more realistic. The heroic ones are gonna be, it's just suppose. some of the others. It's kind of cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Oh. Huh? Oh, nothing. Fledging romance. How'd you end up here? Didn't we we just drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Yeah. Sounds worth it. I was hoping that it wasn't one of those conversations that would just repeat over and over. Thanks. I appreciate it. I better get back to it. Yep. Yep. We've examined the cork boards. We've done... Oh, have we looked in here? Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Yeah, but, um... Clementine? Hey there. Hi. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah. I think so. You're doing a good job. Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. Oh. Sorry about that. This sounds like a fetch quest. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I think so. Uh, being good is good. Despite the circumstances. Yep. Yep. We'll sit tight. Okay. Ah, there's another energy bar! I'm not quite sure what these do. I think these are some kind of like currency. It's like how in Final Fantasy you win a battle and you get some money. You f rub the drugstore and you find an energy bar. Uh. Everything okay? Mm-hmm. 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 It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. 
Yeah, we took care of Clem. Oh boy. Glad that all worked out for everyone. Uh, now where was that office door? Trying to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things out there? Do we look at that? Newspaper clippings. Copies, ten cents. Uh, okay. Now where was that door? It says, oh, there we are. Open office. Alive inside. Uh, loading screen. It's screen full of loading. Oh, there might not have been. No, it's the sad music. Oh, it's Return from Half Life 2. Think about them in here. Did anyone watch that? It was like Barry or Bob died and the music started playing. It's like, no! Bob! No! First aid kit. First aid kit. Don't mind if I do. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. What? Why didn't just take it? That's what you do in these games. So like, came Lee. Here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was her. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Uh, let's see. Look at Clementine. Let's just look at her. Doing? Okay. Okay. Everyone out there seem alright to you? Yeah. Well... Maybe not the sick guy. Yeah, we'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. No. But you stopped it. Yeah, yeah. I did. Yeah, well, well. Can you do that more? Yep. Well, I'm not gonna go looking for him. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. Have you heard from Glenn? Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. Not in a little while, okay. We can repeat that I'm conversation. Keep looking around. Okay. You do that. Move pallet. There's a zombie behind here. I'd be sad. What's that? It's a wacker wacker stick. This is my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My Aww. dad gave it to me. See, dad's just smart like that. Sad music? Why so sad? I ought to clear a path to opening that door. We ought to clear this door for when we find the keys. So maybe we should move the desk. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Yes. Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. <sighs> How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. See, their reactions are natural. Do you have kids? No. No. You don't have a family? What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Oh, good. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I, uh, teach history and writing. <gasps> Yay! Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. I'm a historian! You didn't answer my question. Oh. Alright, a little further. Push it! <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? No. I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? 
Yeah, of course. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I got into some trouble, and, and I didn't talk to them for a while. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay. Because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, well, let's get this done. Little kids are actually quite good at keeping secrets sometimes if you make it important enough. Now don't tell anyone else about this, Jimmy. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. Oh no, she could be infected. I'll find you a bandage. Oh, if only there was a med kit somewhere. Oh, hey, look! Excellent. Them and Betty. came in here hoping to survive. Oh, we already looked at that. It's like one of the most serial wonderfuls my day. Oh, we can't skip it. Great. It'd be a hero, maybe. Maybe if I press Q. No. Released. Oh, it's the TV. Oh. I kept the remote for that thing in here someplace. Lee. Yeah. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, we should keep a lookout. There's no I've point in telling the kid. Oh, your we parents might be dead. Stay close to me until then, okay? When we've got absolutely no certainty that, oh yes, they might be dead, but don't worry, Let's it's just a, a hypothesis. Oh. It hurt. Uh, oh. Let's see if we can do something about it. Uh. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. All the hell. Well done, friends. Let's open the drawer. Oh, it's the remote. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Let's watch the TV. That's what I figured. Yep. Hey, there's electricity. Oh, of course there's electricity. There's light! Oh! Uh, we looked at everything in here. Uh, I think that's all we can find. So what do we have to do? Uh... Will we be able to convince people that the dead guy outside that was trapped under the thing will be able to? I don't know. Find out next time! I hope you enjoy this part and we'll be back shortly.